In the last 24 hours, you've had uh, meetings with Benjamin Netanyahu, the Israeli Prime Minister. When he says that he will only settle for absolute victory against Hamas, it was an hour-long meeting. How do you respond? Well, what I was saying is, look, it's time for an immediate pause in the fighting, because we've got to not only get the aid in, but crucially, we've got to get those hostages out. And what I think we can do now is plan for how you turn that pause into a permanent, sustainable ceasefire without a return to fighting. That's what I was pushing on him, and that's what I'll be talking about here today. Now, for that to happen, a lot of things would have to happen. You'd have to see uh, the Hamas leadership leave Gaza. You'd have to see the instruments of terrorism being dismantled in Gaza. But you've also got to see a political perspective so that Palestinian people can see that there is a route to having a Palestinian state, to having a new future. So it's all those things together that need to form part of a proper plan.